Just me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my, me and my, me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my kicks, me and my, me and my kicks. What is going on YouTube? It's your favorite YouTuber, me and my kicks. And since I'm in Atlanta, I had to go ahead and do another mall vlog. This one is gonna be the Cumberland Mall in Georgia. I'ma go ahead and check it out since I've never been here. And I'ma go ahead and take you on this vlog adventure with me. So as always, like, comment, subscribe. Also comment down below if you've ever been to Cumberland Mall or if you ever visited Georgia, then we can chop it up in the comment section. And as always, let's get This this different on the vans. Um, as you can see, they're white and red checker. That's a uh, Velcro. And if you could, if you want to, you could take off this uh, white and black van sign. So if you want to like switch it up and have like a white and a red checker van or a white and black checker van, you can do that. I got it on both sides. First time seeing that. Have, haven't seen this colorway at all in the Kyrie Lowe's. It's not bad. It's like a nice little Easter type colorway. I wouldn't, I wouldn't get them personally, but something to look at. They still got, got KD9s at this um, House of Hoops. I don't know why. They need to just go ahead and throw this at the outlet because we on KD11 right now. About to be on KD12 sometime soon, but that's crazy. Here's a, here's a new colorway in those Kobe's. I'm not really a fan of it. What do you guys think about it? This colorway better than the other one, but you know. Here go the Purple Rain Kobe Pro Trail ones. I wish they had them out on the floor so I could like see them, but not bad. I prefer the white ones. I reviewed those. I put it up above if you want to check it out. One thing that's different about this mall is that the shoe stores are upstairs as opposed to being downstairs. The only store that's downstairs is the House of Hoops. That's weird. I remember on Complex, Lil Yachty was on there and he said that uh, Reebok tried to like give him a shoe to wear and he didn't really mess with uh, Reebok like that or he didn't like the design. Now look at him wearing the Aztecs. I bet you this shoe look way worse than any shoe that um gave to them but I never seen this colorway in the um, Hirachis it's pretty decent nice little desert camo and they also got like a green uh, camo right here as, as well they all on sale for 80 bucks it's not bad though apparently apparently that new Red Dead Redemption 2 drop but uh, if you got it comment that down below and let me know if you got it I played Red Dead Redemption 1 definitely a classic game I don't really have time to play games like that but eventually I'll grab it I go to 2.5s uh, PG's the colorway is not too bad. I don't know why they dropped this red one right here, but then they got another red right here. The same colorway, both shoes. I, ne I never heard of this uh, brand before. It's called Snicker Project. They like they got some fake uh, Balenciagas going on up in here. I mean, it's only like 94 bucks. So if you want to get you a Balenciaga look, but not necessarily the shoes, y'all could definitely mess with these. Here at Jimmy Jazz, they got a, another little colorway of that long boot Timberland with the jean upper and the regular Timberland bottom. But this hat go decent with them, I ain't gonna lie. They definitely made a nice hat to go with them. Pretty decent design. This colorway recently just came out in the pennies. This is a great colorway, maroon with that gold. I was um, at school, I got a couple of people who was in Fyro Ada Fraternity Incorporated, and this is the exact colors that they wear. I told them they need to cop these shoes ASAP to match their uh, frat color. Apparently it's this duck boot season uh, upon us because they got the duck boot lows and they got these green ones. I'm not really a fan of the green ones, but these navy ones pretty decent. Just passed up a journey, so I figured I'd get a little uh, pics of the recent van slash Disney collaboration that came out. These cute for uh, little girls. Nice little couple colorways. Looks like at this location they made the foot action of Flight 23. Pretty decent. We're going to head check it out. Here's another colorway in those uh, alternate 13 Tinker joints. 
I'm not a fan of the alternate 13s at all, and this colorway is, is trash. I just had to show you something since I went up on a band. They recently restocked the um, Jordan Future Premiums, and this is pretty decent. Let me go ahead and throw that flash on. Here's how they look with the flash on. It's crazy. When these first released, people, re people was reselling them for like 300 bucks, but now, since they restocked, like it's been dead as far as like a uh, resale goes. This is the first time I've seen these at an actual store. These like the Reebok DMX 2000, something like that. Um, oh, the RBK DMX Low. Um, this is Swiss Beat Shoe. I have not seen these in stores. I, I need to catch these on like a super, super sale, like 50 bucks. If I can get these for 50, 40 bucks, I'll cop a pair. And as always, they got these uh, camera on Reebok questions. They recently retro these. These are the answer ones and a white red and black colorway i'm in a couple of reebok groups they've been going crazy for this shoe but and they they, they thought at first they are uh, restocked in china and they didn't think it was going to come over to the states but all they had to do was wait so now they're here if it, now if you really want them you can definitely cop them now these pink tins just dropped recently um in my opinion they okay nice little slight colorway for the ladies Nothing too crazy. All right, guys, back in the car from the mall. Overall, I definitely thought it was a great mall. They had a lot of shoe stores from Athlete's Foot to Jimmy Jazz to DTLR, etc. And I like the fact that they had those Reebok Answer Ones in there because eventually I definitely want to get a pair of those in my collection, but I'm gonna wait till they go on sale because nobody don't really be checking for uh, Answer Ones like that. But if you like this video, hit that thumbs up. Also, if you've ever been to the Cumberland Mall or if you've ever been to Georgia, just comment that down below and we can chop it up in the comment section. Also, if you aren't subscribed to the channel, what are you doing, man? Hit that subscribe button. It takes nothing but a couple of seconds and you'll be notified when I drop future videos. And lastly, peace.